Hello everyone, this is Helen and I'm Cosmos Crafty Mom. And today is day number 20 of our March Madness on YouTube. Woohoo! So today I'm not doing a craft. Um, today I'm going to share an idea that, I, that I've been doing. Um, and I thought it might be beneficial to you. <laughs> um, if you want to send out happy mail or do a swap. Um, so previously what I was doing is if I was doing a swap with someone, I was going back through all their videos and having to um, watch their videos, which was great, but it takes a lot of time to do that. <laughs> um, so going forward, what I'm going to be doing, and this isn't the actual book that I'm using, but um, I didn't want to show the actual personal information. But what I did um, want to give you an idea, like this I bought at the Dollar Tree, so it's an index card. Um, and then you can put all the index um, of your different um, YouTube friends that you that you have, and then you can physically write um, information about them. So, for example, if someone is doing a uh, like a birthday swap, for example, and they ask for a Memdex card, if you listen to all the people that come in, sometimes your YouTube friends are gonna be um, sending in a Memdex card, and then you'll know their birthday. <laughs> so then you would just take a sheet, and then you would write. Oh, I know, I'm going to use an example of Barbara because I don't know a personal Barbara, but um, you can write down things as you hear on their channel or from other YouTubers when they open Happy Mail, that type of thing. So um, this is like a sample. So I would write like, you know, Barbara, um, I know her birthday is October 16th because I heard someone read off a of Memdex. Um, I already know her favorite color is blue. I know that she has a dog named Coco. Uh, I know that she loves Hello Kitty because she talks about it on her channel all the time. I know that she loves journal making, scrapbooking, um, that she lives in Florida, and she loves to travel. So these um, these are good for ideas to save you time because at the end of the day, um, you know, there's quite a few of us that have full-time jobs, a family. You don't always have the time to go through all the videos. Um, so when you can pick up things as you go along, it's good to not to jot it down. So, you know, if I hear something about, you know, Susie, for example, I can go into her file and write it down. And so what's great about these is you can pull them out um, and then you can refile it. So there's a system here um, and I would put like, for example, birthdays from, uh, let's say January till April and then the middle of the year and then the end of the year. And then you can put all the cards in between. And then if I want to send out birthday happy mail, um, I'm going to know when all the birthdays are in April. And I just have to look at my cards and it will tell me whose birthdays are in April, in June, October, etc. So I just thought this was a good idea to um, share what I'm going to be doing going forward to be more efficient. <laughs> because I find um, when I do a swap with someone right now or, or try to send happy mail, I'm struggling because I, I don't know. I feel like I maybe were watching videos before but maybe I didn't pay attention but if I start jotting things down on different people then in the future it's gonna be easy I already know what they like right so um, I'm gonna do this for my favorite youtubers um, ones that I've sent swaps to or, or planning on sending a happy mail to in the future um, I want to have their information um, you know recorded for me so that I know this person loves blue so I'm not gonna send them pink stuff I'm gonna send them blue stuff right um, the other thing too, another tip, um, I've stopped watching TV. Pretty much now I listen to YouTubers and um, I may not watch everything in full detail, like I'll glance back and forth when they have you know different things, um, but I listen to them. So then too, when I'm listening to them crafting, I'll have out my handy little journal again and I'll write down things as they're talking. So I just thought this was a good way to keep track of your favorite um, your favorite YouTubers or people in life and things that you want to send out to um, by you know tracking it down and having a card for each person that that you like or want to um, you know do a swap with or send happy mail it's just gonna make it so much easier for you because right now my goal I think going forward is to save as much time as possible <laughs> um, because as I realize I'm a slow crafter um, I have great ideas but sometimes I'm too much of a perfectionist and it takes me a while to get things done um, because I'm thinking, oh, could I do something better? Could I do this? Would this person like? So I over, how can I say? I sometimes I'm a little bit insecure um, 
because I want so much to please that person. I want them to know that I thought about them and I took the time um, to really get to know them. So now, um, if I keep listening to videos as I go forward, you know, I could be doing some crafts and they're like, oh, you know, Sh Cheryl came on and she said this, this, and this. Then I can go back and write all that down. So I just wanted to share this idea with you. I think it's a great idea because it's going to save me so much time going forward. Um, so this little book has 60 units, but I mean, you know, if you send out 60 packages throughout the year to people, um, it's just good to know to have this information. And sometimes it's also future YouTubers. Like I knew I wanted to send something to someone, um, and I waited to ask them to do a pocket letter swap. Um, but when I did, I had everything bought because I knew I've been collecting over time what they liked. <laughs> so then when it came time to do it, even though I was slow at sending it out, I knew exactly what I was sending them because I, you know, was paying attention and I, every time I'd go to the store, I'd look for this particular color or these particular things because I knew that person liked that. So it's just to keep in top of mind also when you're doing hauls and stuff, when you see, um, you know, papers and colors and stuff and you see, oh, you know, I have this um, blue paper, right? Oh, I know a few people who really love blue. I must make sure. And sometimes what I do too is I put things in the iris case, you know, those big cases, and I'll put stuff in there for future people right so if someone likes cats for example I'll buy cat stuff and so I have a, co a collection of cat stuff so when I do another swap with them or, or happy mail I'll have that ready because it's in a container and I know it's for like I don't mix it with my other stuff I know it's for certain people that I want to do um, happy mail for or swaps on YouTube so I just wanted to share my quick idea with you guys uh, let me know what you think below um, um, please make sure to give Cosmo and myself a pause up. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, Cosmo and I would be delighted to have you subscribe. And then if you stay tuned, there'll be a quick video of Cosmo at the end of this video. Take care, guys. See you on the next day. Take care. Bye.